Welcome back brothers and sisters to so Unstop Faith channel where we're simply walking by faith and not by sight. That's right. It's about pleasing the Lord and the only way you and I can please Him is to walk by faith, is to live a faith lifestyle. Hallelujah. Whatever you do in words or deed, you do it in the Word of God. You do it in the faith, having faith in God. Hallelujah. And it's so important that we live a blessed life, a successful life in Christ Jesus. Not according to the, the status quo of this world, but according to God's perfect will to each and every one of us. I want to title this message, The Lord's Will. Go with me in the Word. Hallelujah. All right, let's look at Luke chapter 22. It says in verse uh, 29, sorry 39 in niv translation jesus went out as usual to the mount of olives and his disciples followed him on reaching the place he said to them pray that you will not fall into temptation he withdrew about a stone's throw beyond them knelt down and prayed father if you are willing take this cup from me yet not my will but yours be done hallelujah what an awesome word jesus prayed and jesus is our example he prayed that the father's will be done it is so important that we know the lord's will and to know his will jesus showed us the example we have to go to him in prior it is so so important know his will for your life his will will take you into purpose. Hallelujah. His will will, will will let you have the vision. Why are you here on earth? Hallelujah. What must you do while you are here on earth? We have to seek the Lord's will. It is so important to know the Lord's will. Hallelujah. It gives us joy, such peace. That surpass all understanding when you know the Lord's will, you know why you are here. It makes a difference, ladies and gentlemen. Hallelujah. So I, I ask you, I urge you, know the Lord's will for your life. You probably never thought about it. And oh, you know, I'm just doing what I need to do. No, no, no. Remember, when we come to God, the Lord is our shepherd. If you don't know him, it's the, it's the greatest thing you can ever do while you're here on earth is to accept his word, is to believe that Jesus Christ died for your sins. Hallelujah. And because of that, he rose from the grave. Because if he didn't rose from the grave, then all fate would be in vain. He rose from the grave. He's at the right hand of the Father, making intercession for us so we can live a free life. But while we are here, what is the Lord's will for your life and for my life. You have to go to him. Jesus said, Father, not my will. Because sometimes you're doing things and you're getting rejection. You're getting a lot of different opposition and different things are coming your way. But because it's not your will, it's his will. Because your will, you probably want to throw in the towel. <laughs> Hallelujah. But when you know His will for your life, His will to bless you, His will to prosper you, His will to see you finish strong, His will is that you live a life that is pleasing to Him. A good man's step, the Bible says, is ordered by the Lord. There's something that you're good at. There's, there's some questions that only you alone can answer what do i mean by that? there are some problems that only you alone have the answer to because just as our fingerprints are different hallelujah our biometrics are different we are unique hello yes you are unique you have a purpose on this earth hallelujah so don't just live as if there's no hope Brothers and sisters, God's beloved, there is a way. There is more to what you're experiencing right now. Woo! Glory to God. When, when the veil has been removed and you can see clearly 
of what God has called you to do, it's a beautiful thing. So I urge you, seek to know his will. Hallelujah. Stay for part two, because I believe this is going to bless you. You know, uh, a guy has a situation and you need God to help him. And he asks God about if it's his will concerning the situation. So stay for part two. But right now, I urge you, seek to know the Lord's will. God bless you, cause his face to shine upon you. Until we meet again, we're going to continue to walk by faith and not by sight. Remember, before you go, hit the like button, hit the subscribe, and hit the notification bell until I see you next time. Keep walking by faith. Doo -doo.